back with another video. Let's get it. I had to upgrade, sell some things, you know. A Manta Queen. Yeah. We felled it, mind. But... A stranger comes to our home. If you're looking for a path to walk, you've found one. If you're looking for a teacher, I am one. Welcome to the Iconoclasts. Shed the trappings of a materialistic life, Captain. You'll find your soul much less burdened. Also, we're broke. Yes. If we were meant to enjoy the things that glitter and shine, the universe would provide them. Makes sense. You need to survive mm, so they can buy. Most of Halcyon isn't up Sulphur Creek. I'd wager the opposite. The corporations are doomed. Only we have the truth at our backs, and we are better for it. Now, why have you come? Stop. No. Spreading the truth is the only way to combat the board's poisonous campaign of propaganda against their people. I realize the board has blockaded our efforts, but Devil's Peak is an interplanetary radio tower. Surely somebody is listening. Surely. I've been around the call and never heard of it. It's not that it's getting out. It's the people who it doesn't care. Uh, excuse me, I'm from Edgewater on Terra 2. If you'll pardon my saying, nobody I know has ever heard of you. All the more reason to double down on our efforts. Graham, we should be focusing on survival anyway. Food, ammo, and medicine. Maybe now's the time to pivot. Pivot, huh? If radio isn't working, we might try another way. It seems the captain's timing is more than just serendipitous. It must be fate. I've had my sights on an old printing press for some time. The board uses magazines and advertisements to subtly focus the colony's attention. We will use their tricks against them. Wait, that's not what I meant. Help me clear out and repair the press, and I will have no need for that rust bucket of a radio tower. This sounds fair. Hold on, you saying you want me to print propaganda in the magazine? I need some time to consider it. That's too much. I'll just kill you now and be done with it. Let's try Wonderful. That first. I requisitioned replacement rollers for it some time ago. Huxley should have delivered them yesterday. Speaking of which, where is Huxley? You bought rollers? You haven't even cleared the wraps out yet. What are you doing wasting bits on. Wait, where is Huxley? It seems we're out a runner. If you intend to help our cause, I'll ask you to meet our MSI supplier in her stead. Seems you're out of a runners. 
She meets us in the ruins of Bayside Terrace. From our compound, follow the road north. One of our sympathizers, a woman named Carlotta, periodically buys goods on our behalf from Stellar Bay's store. Stellar Bay has caught on, but they remain friendly, though the goods now come at a considerable markup. Wonderful. While you're at it, I wonder if Carlotta still has those high-capacity cartridges? Grab a few, will you? There should be some funds left over from the last shipment. We can use them to copy and modify radio serials. Yes, not just magazines, but their precious dramas. Unbelievable. I hope I don't have to tell you this, but if there is extra money, would you mind buying, I don't know, food and medicine? Graham, if you need me, I'll be in triage. Take care of stuff, y'all ain't gotten it. What do you think of the unreliable Parvati? There's We do this. Excuse me, but this area's off limits. We got a leaky generator. It ain't safe. That's my nice way of telling you to saw it off. <laughs> oh. And I'm just gonna let you walk on in? Why is that now? All right, you're gonna saw it off already? Nah, bro, I'm about to kill you in a minute. We're fixing a leaky generator. What's it to you? Right, Carlotta. Yeah, she's inside. We got first rights, though. Soon as we fix that generator, she's ours. You'd have to ask the boss. I just know she wants Carlotta voided. We're fixing a leaky generator. What's it to you? What are you, a safety inspector? It's busted. Pumping out gas. It ain't safe. Oh, whoops. I'll get right on that, boss. Mm -hmm. Hope this ain't in my performance review. It is, um... Shoot. 
a suit with the... I want to use the aliens for that. Hello? Relax. I've been cooped up in here for almost two days. Who are you anyway? Thanks for clearing out those goons. Please don't kill me next. <laughs> Bram ordered rollers and wetsits, right? For a printing press? Here, yeah. take them. Like I said, this is my last run. Law help them. I don't know. Maybe Sublight can lend a hand. I should go. Look, Graham's got a bit or two left in his account. I can send one last dropout before I wash my hands of this. What do you want delivered? I always took that woman for the sensible type. Good on her. I'll send some along. Give them all my regards. And good luck out there. Don't go getting eaten. I don't really see myself using
the fast travel, right? What's over here? Did you have a sweetheart in Stellar Bay? I had a fling or two, sure. But on Monarch, relationships ain't usually meant to last. A lot of fools tried to impress me, feigning bravado in the wilds, thinking they'd catch my attention with their stories. It was cute. Not so cute when their act got themselves munched. I'm telling you, the Van Noys are fine. Bullshit, Graham. They don't just abandon orders, and they weren't at the ruins. Where in this sulfur-sodden hellhole did you send them? They're on a very important... Ah, we'll continue this later. Welcome back, Captain. Thank the Eternal that someone's got some sense in their head. Carlotta usually schedules the next drop during the meeting. When's she coming? That is most unfortunate. This cuts off one of our only two supply lines on Monarch. Sanjar, old friend, you're about to cross a dangerous line. About to? That idiot just declared war. I... we will deal with his subversion later. For now, we must redouble our efforts to spread the truth to the colony. The print... oh no. Graham, you didn't. I've already sent a team ahead to scout the press. One of our best. Meet them there and find out if they've been successful. Probably not. You sent the Van Noys there, didn't you? Oh, for fuck's sake, Graham! We needed them in the ruins! Our people died out there! They went willing to fight for our cause. We need reinforcements. We need new recruits. The Van Noys saw the printing facility with the same importance as I. Is a printing press really worth all these people's lives? There's gotta be a better way to get your message out. I have the utmost confidence in their abilities. Friends, we must have faith that the men and women we recruit can handle the duties for which we recruit them. You could have sent them at their back and was already up, right? Did you two ever stop back Yes! You're damn right he could have, but he's so obsessed with preaching that he's become blind to our actual problems. Look, just... If the Van Noys are still alive, get them out of there. With Sanjar pressing the issue like this, I have a feeling we'll need them. It's time to shoot you and get it over with, bro. I hate male egos, bro. They don't do nothing but cause more and more destruction. Man, more and more destruction they cause.
make sure y'all drink some water today. Water, water, water. I'm about to cut it out and then we can go do this print and press or whatever they got going on. But like I said, man, that male ego stuff need to cut it out, bro. Because don't you see that that male ego stuff never fix the situation. Ever. Sometimes you need to listen to the lady, man. Sometimes. 